stay for Dwayne Haskins didn't come up, but I wanted to say a rest in peace. And I also wanted to call out Gil Brandt and Adam Scheffner. Them two racist bigot trashes were going to speak. The guy had just been killed trying to cross the highway, killed by a dump truck. And he took time to throw shots at him. That just shows you how the NFL plantation is. This young man was only 24, about to turn 25, back a quarterback for Pittsburgh. And I do believe, I know he was going to be at least second string. He was battling Mitchell Trubisky, and he was better than that Rudolph. So I knew. Didn't really get a chance to shine in Washington when he came out of Ohio State. He was something else in Ohio State. I'm a Michigan Wolverines fan, so it's tough. But I remember how good Dwayne Haskins was. I remember what the potential. And he had those situations in Washington. But they suck. Their owner is garbage. And Ron Revere, who's a good coach, it's going to take a lot to get that back because they had to change their racist name, among other things. So he goes to Pittsburgh, and he looked all right. He was coming along. We don't know how anything's going to go because it's all systematic. No quarterback comes into the NFL and just jumps off and looks great. So you just don't know. But anyway, these biggest come out of the woodwork taking shots at him as opposed to mourning the loss. Let his family heal. Let his friends heal. He didn't ask for all that. He's just a young pup, about to turn 25 in a month. So, you know, my condolences and thoughts. However, these sideline haters, they can go kick rocks, Gil Brandt and Adam Scheffner. They can go kick some rocks. You need to mourn and put some respect by Dwayne Haskins' name. Young man killed and died way too soon. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts and comments. And I do respond, thank you. Wash your hands, keep your mind clear, watch out for another, and take no time for granted because one never knows. Every day is a gift, every moment is precious. I'm out.